When I teach kids, sometimes I tell them the best story in the world ever. It goes like this. Once upon a time, there was a kingdom of light ruled by a generous king. The princess was as wise as she was fair, and all the people were very happy. The end. Of course, the children know that's not the best story in the world ever. The best story in the world involves struggle. So the story continues. One day, the princess noticed the door to the dungeon was ajar. She knew she shouldn't, but... Lower and lower she descends until she sees chained to the wall a dazzling dragon. The dragon said, Don't yell, I need your help. Help? Says the princess. My father told me you came to destroy our kingdom. Destroy? No, I came to free you. I came to teach you to fly. And if you release me, I'll teach you. With quivering hands, she pulled the lever, releasing the shackles and snap! The dragon grabbed her in his talons and carried her off to his lair across the sea. Distraught, the king asks the knights of the realm, Who will rescue my daughter? None of them were brave enough, except a simple shepherd from the hills. The king said, You, I will make you a knight. Bring back the princess. So the newly made knight sailed through deadly storms. He fought terrible monsters. He climbed perilous mountains and he came to the dragon's lair. In an almighty fight to the death, the knight was completely overpowered. And when it looked like all was lost, somehow he trapped the dragon in the cell that had held the princess. The dragon was defeated, the princess was saved, and they returned to the kingdom of light. With joy, the king received back his daughter, and she received the knight as her husband. So they all lived happily ever after. That's the best story in the world ever. Because it's every story. It's the great quest, it's overcoming the monster, it's rags to riches, it's love lost and then found, it's tragedy turned to comedy, and the happily ever after. Perhaps these stories thrill our hearts because they echo a true story. Perhaps there really is an ultimate hero who came on a mission to fight evil, to give up his life, to rise again and to be one with his people forever. What if the fairy tale is true? What if Jesus is the hero of heroes? What if Easter is the myth that really happened? <laughs>